was consequence against you. Obviously, everybody says that they've got the best fans, but your fans have tweeted about you 2.5 million times in the last two weeks. It's obviously for the MTV star competition, but like, how grateful are you when stuff like that happens? I mean, it's pretty amazing. I mean, people do say that they have the best fans in the world, but we have a unique insight because we've toured with almost every band in the world. <laughs> so we actually know for a fact that we do have the best audience out there. Is it important for you to create that relationship and maintain it then with the fans? Uh, yeah, it's important. It's a fun thing to do. I think that, you know, but it also has to be native to who you are. You, mm. can't, you can't force that. Lost in the city. about City of Angels. So the video for this, it's amazing. Like I was almost tearing up watching it. It was difficult getting all of these people involved. It's, it's always difficult to corral uh, really busy people. Yes. Um, so that was hard. It wasn't as difficult to get a yes from the people that we really wanted. The city took my mother, but the city also gave me my child. I've disappointed myself the most in my life. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm a Disney kid. People try to tell me what to do every single day. I think they think I'm goody-goody, I'm boring, I use people, so then there's that. You visit so many places. Do you notice that, like for in Dublin, for instance, do you get a kind of a sense of a city when you get to visit it? I know that you're kind of in hotel rooms and stuff, but... Yeah, I like Dublin a lot because it's a walking city. Yeah. You can wander around. You can get uh, lost and it's really beautiful, but probably the nicest part of Dublin and, and Ireland is, uh, uh, or the people. Um, We're good people. That's We're good probably people. <laughs> good people, man. Yeah. How proud are you guys of Jared? Because of course, uh, this, you've been tipped to, to get an Oscar for your latest role in uh, Dallas Buyers Club. So how proud are you guys of him? I mean, the movie's incredible. His performance is incredible, you know. Jared does good work. Jared does good work. It's uh, for us. It's a common trend. You know, yeah. we're, we're nothing new for us. I mean, he does everything. He does really is pretty great. So. Yeah. <laughs> and what do you think? Do you think he's gonna? You think he's gonna win? Oh, I. Uh, it's, yeah, he better win. <laughs> I've been looking for you, Lone Star. This is Tinkerbell. Unless you got more cash or new clients, I'm busy. You don't deserve our money. Cut you in. Five percent. Twenty-five. Take it or leave it. Were you absolutely starving the entire way through? I mean, obviously you had to lose so much weight. Was that really challenging? Just just the hunger pains even. Yeah, it was. Um, it was really challenging, but I think that was probably part of the point as well. I put on a backpack, saved up a couple hundred bucks, and I came to Los Angeles to make myself. What are you guys looking forward to most now, the year coming? I mean, we have about a month of touring left for 2013. We're pretty excited about that. Two more shows over here, Europe and UK, and uh, back to the States to finish off the year. We've got holidays coming up. Cool. I mean, you know, this has been a busy year. It's, an, yeah, it's kind of funny when you're saying holidays, because you know, I can't imagine that you guys have normal lives at all. So, like, your Christmas, what are you guys going to be doing? Just like normal? Chilling. Chilling out? Chilling, yeah. Awesome. The city of I just wanted to be 